Jersey Sports Zone's wrestling coverage is brought to you by RWJ Barnabas Health. We have a tremendous season opener on the mat in Richland as Absagami travels to face St. Augustine in Cape Atlantic League action. Both teams looking to make a strong opening statement on Friday night. Back and forth we go starting at 175. Colin Olivo picks up a third period pin on Kevin Guerrero to give the Hermits an early 6-0 lead. Gammy gets it right back at 190. George Rhodes looking dominant as he wins by fall in the second period to tie things up at 6. The Braves keep the momentum going at 215. Adrian Martinez Ruiz works a first period pin on Ryan Small, and Absagami is in front 12 6 after back to back pins. St. Augustine's turn for a response at heavyweight. Ed Vincent gets Jose Amaro's shoulders on the mat for a second period pin to even the duel at 12. Robert Meyer trying to keep things rolling for the prep at 106. Meyer secures the pin for the Hermits as they now lead 18-12 after five bouts. Gammy trying to bounce back at 113. Nick Gargione takes the back of Max McCoy for a takedown as Gargione wins by decision to make it 18-15. St. Augustine wins by forfeit at 120 and 126. We pick things up at 132. Anthony DePaul scores two near fall points at the buzzer to win by major decision and make it 34-15. Absagami trails 37-15 after a Brandon Borman decision victory. The Braves need a pin and Christopher Eaton delivers with a second period pin at 144 to pull Gammy within 16 with three bouts to go. The prep can seal things up at 150 pounds. Cooper Lang fighting for position and scores on the takedown to win 6-4 in overtime. Lang clinches a season opening win for the Hermits. 46-24 is your final. St. Augustine starts the season at 1-0. Absagami falls to 0-1. In Richland, Dom James Mooney, JerseySportsZone.com.